16 signs a guy likes and is into you. Number 16, two texts in a row. No, he did not. Did that guy just text you twice in a row without making you wait? And he's not your boss asking you to work late? Girl, he's not just eager, he's grade A into you. Look, no guy wants to appear desperate by lighting up your phone with text after text. So, if he's doing this, he is hot on your trail and wants you to notice. This also means he is confident with openly communicating with you. This is not every man, though. There are still those who prescribe to texting in far between intervals. You know, so they don't have to come off as too desperate. This brings us to our next point the waiting game. Number 15. Can we just throw this sophomore game right out the relationship window? This guy is totally into you and is trying not to come off too strong or seem too desperate for attention and conversation. He'll text you back every time, but will wait an unusually long time between texts. This guy digs you and likely wants you to show more interest. This way he can inch himself closer without feeling like he's overstepping his boundaries. The major indication he likes you is that he constantly texts you back. If he's just being spotty and dodgy, then you may not be dealing with a willing man. Make sure there are other clear signs of interest, just in case he isn't actually playing hard to get. Know the difference so you don't get hurt if you like him, and avoid a potentially embarrassing situation if you misread his signals. Number 14. Grocery Store Buddy When a guy is willing to do simple things with you, such as a casual stop at the grocery store, he's interested in you and enjoys spending time with you, especially if he's inviting himself or asking if you'd like him to tag along. Based on your mutual needs for sustenance, it's a win-win. Can you blame him for exploiting this loophole? If the grocery trips begin to feel a little like dates, maybe something beyond friendship is brewing. A potential bonus is that a man who shops well might also cook well. Number 13. An open book. He is not an open book with everyone. He's introducing you to his interests because he's motivated to find common ground between the two of you. When a guy goes out of his way to share personal interests with you, he is also revealing his deeper self, maybe in an attempt to impress you with his vast interests and knowledge. This is a great position because it may reveal some important details about his character and principles. After all, a guy who tells you what he has just named his puppy will probably give you different vibes than the one who lets you in on his deep-rooted obsession with collecting fingernail clippings. Ugh. Number 12. The Introduction you are at a trendy bar or a crowded party and a guy approaches you. He can either be alone or with a friend. The important detail is that he is introducing himself to you and trying to strike up conversation. This guy has probably noticed you since you stepped through the door and has finally decided to make a move. If he talks to you for more than a few minutes and remains engaged, this is a good sign he's interested, unless you sense an ulterior motive such as making another girl jealous. He's likely a guy who wants to create a spark with a pretty girl. Number 11, the cold shoulder. This one provides nice contrast from the forward type and is also a bit counterintuitive. Some guys have figured out that women really don't like to be ignored, so they will purposefully ignore you in an attempt to get you interested. It's not as easy to read this type of guy correctly and probably the last way that you want a guy to show his intentions. But some people enjoy challenges, so this behavior works on some personality types. It's important to observe the context around a situation like this. Maybe he's annoyed with you, hence ignoring you. So it's probably not an attempt to lead you on. If a guy that appears shy or you don't know well is giving a cold shoulder, it could be a variety of reasons. However, if it's a guy who's friendly with you and has displayed other signs of interests, he's more than likely playing this little game with you. Number 10, remembers details. One biggie is that he remembers your name after your first time meeting. No matter how brief or casual it was, if he remembers your name, that's a sign that he's either on top of things, interested in you, or both. Those are all good signs in my book.
or he could have looked you up to remember your name. That's either creepy or sweet. You need to be the judge of that. To test whether or not he is paying attention to you, refer back to what you said a few minutes ago just to see if he's following. Don't interrogate the poor guy because you'll scare him away, but just discreetly checking if he's on the same page is a good way to measure his interest and memory, <laughs> lol. If you can tell that he has no idea what you've been talking about, he probably has his mind elsewhere and isn't in the moment with you. On the other hand, if he is engaged and responding with interest and sincerity, that means he cares. Number 9. He's a giver. A giving guy naturally makes attempts at the most basic and primitive male instinct to provide. He is essentially showing you that he is capable of keeping you satisfied. There really shouldn't be another reason that a guy would regularly buy or lend you things. An honorable one, anyway. If a guy insists on buying you and only you every coffee, then he wants to impress you. If the attempts at winning you over with material goods seem too desperate, then look at that as a sign and back off. And if there is good occasion to give you a gift, but the man doesn't take advantage of the opportunity, this could also be a sign that he is not attentive or genuine. Number 8. Old News to His Friends when you are introduced to his friends, you feel like they have heard about you a thousand times. Maybe it even seems like they were anticipating your qualities or already having questions about details about your life that they couldn't have possibly known. If this is the case, it's because your name has been regularly spewing forth from his mouth. He hasn't been able to contain himself, so he's been gushing about you to his buddies. If they seem to have inside jokes and are cold towards you, that may indicate something rude has been said. If they are kind and treat you with respect, this is a sign that your potential man has good character and is respectful. Number 7. Tell Tale Toes Look down. See his toes? Where are they pointing? Well, if they're pointing right at you the whole time you're talking, then you have an energetically interested man on your hands. What a gift! As long as this guy isn't a creeper, I'd say he's a keeper. But if his feet are wandering and his body seems to be pulling away from you, then he might just want to escape. So really look at his body language and try to translate it. If you listen to your intuition, you will know if you're standing across from a potential partner. Number 6. Eyes tell no lies. Doesn't that slip off the tongue well? I think so. Anyway, it's true. If his eyes dart away from yours, he may feel uncomfortable and want to exit your convo. However, if your eyes lock at first sight and throughout your conversation, it's a magical feeling and a great sign. You should see his eyes light up with interest when you speak to him. The goal is to see a spark of happiness in his eyes when you look at each other. This sign cannot be mistaken. You'll feel it in his gaze if he really cares about you. So pay special attention to his eyes. They truly are windows to the soul. Just a quick note though, even if he does not gaze into your eyes or hold them in his for more than a beat, he still might like you. He just might be a little shy, and that's cool too. Number 5. Digital Exuberance Oh yeah, the day after you meet him, He's already added you on every social media platform. This guy has even endorsed all of your skills on the linked biz sites. Now, he's sending you that casual, hey, blah, 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 let's meet up via Instagram. While this may come off as intrusive, this is the world we live in. Technology has its place. You're currently checking out these tips, right? The best move is to respond back and see what he has in mind. This could be the beginning of something great, created in part by the strange magic of technology. I suggest you pair his online interest with genuine interest. Stalkers are not active, nor <laughs> ideal mates. Number 4. Relationship Detective so, do you have a boyfriend? Seeing anyone? He suddenly asks when the opportunity arises. If he hears that you are not taken, his interest in you will likely increase. You should begin to notice even more signals that he's into you. If a guy asks you this type of question, it gives you the opportunity to declare your intentions. You can turn him away by replying something along the lines of, no, because I don't want one right now. Or maybe you are, in fact, single and totally ready to mingle. Number 3. The Lean-In It's almost as if you're a magnet and he is a man-shaped pillar of steel. Whenever the two of you talk, he seems to lean closer and closer until he is practically on your lap. 
it's not like he's moving in for a kiss, much more like he's trying to seem as engaged as possible, resulting in him eventually encroaching on your personal bubble. If you find this type of situation occurs on a regular basis, this guy is totally crushing on you. Number 2. Laughing Partners you are sitting in a big group and someone cracks a joke that sends everyone into a laughing frenzy. This is a prime situation to feel out the intentions of the present man. If a guy is into you, he might look at you every time he laughs. This is a major sign that in his mind, there is already a connection between you. People tend to look at the person that they are most comfortable with or desire the most when they laugh in a group setting. Next time you're pondering if a guy is into you, just wait for a moment of laughter and try to spot who gaze is beaming in your direction. Number 1. Your interests are his Lo and behold, that band you introduced him to last week is now his new jam. Oh, and that movie you told him about? Also his new fave? This either means the two of you are just naturally similar, or more likely he's trying to build connections between you with similarities in taste. Watch for a pattern to emerge. If you notice that he continues with this type of behavior, it's because he really likes you. If you decide to pursue him, it will be interesting to see how similar the two of you really are. Please hit like, share, and comment below if you want to help us grow. Thanks for watching.